Hey, what's going on? It's your boy BT, and I came here to talk some boxing with the thousands of True School Sports subscribers. Now, the deal is done, it's been finalized, it's been signed, sealed, and delivered. May 12th, Madison Square Garden, the best pound for pound fighter in boxing. I don't give a damn what you say, all right? But Seal Lomachenko will be taking on another you know, pound for pound level talent in himself in its own right in Jorge Linares, and it's gonna be a great fight. Lomachenko's first fight at 135, Madison Square Garden. Probably the biggest fight of his career to date. Um gonna be an exciting time. Exciting, exciting uh, fights. Now I am glad they finally got this done because there was an issue between Bob Aram and Oscar De La Hoya. Um De La Hoya who promotes Linares. Um, also has the Gennady Golovkin Canelo Alvarez replay scheduled to happen on May 12th, which was the day this fight was finalized. They came to an agreement that the fight will be televised by ESPN um, at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time um, because the, uh, De La Hoya didn't want another promoter's fighters competing with uh, his ratings, you know, for, 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 for the Gennady Golovkin Canelo fight. So, you know, fair play to them. They, they came to an agreement, and ultimately, the, the, the ones that are winning out on the end is the fans. Thank God they got this fight done. And credit to Fasil Lomachenko for taking this fight, man. Uh, 135, first fight, he's going after Linares. The same Linares that uh, Mike Garcia ducked, who he could have been fought in January. So, you got, for those of you who are throwing salt all over this man's name, saying he's a ducker, he's a coward, he's a cherry picker, he's nobody, he's overrated, you know, you need to go look yourself in the damn mirror and ask yourself. Do I know anything about boxing? And hopefully your reflection in the mirror and when you look deep into your soul will tell you, no, you don't know anything about boxing. Because this man, Lomachenko, continuously tries to fight the best opponents available to him. And uh, he's fighting Linares, a guy who uh, is a good body puncher, a fun fighter to watch. It should be a good fight. And I'm interested to see how Lomachenko deals with the style of Linares, the body punching Linares. I'm hoping when... Linares can get Lomachenko into adversity because he really hasn't had a lot of adversity since his Lito fight. He's just making do that fighter after fighter after fighter after fighter quit on the stool. And we're tired of that. We want to see Lomachenko in some adversity. We want to see uh, him tested. We want, we want to see just the character of, of him beyond just the talent. We know he's oh, extra talent. We know he's very talented. But I want to see a great fight. Um, so credit to these two guys for agreeing to the fight. Credit to Bob Aram and De La Hoya for, 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 for making a deal happen. And overall, I'm just excited about it. This, this is the kind of fight that I like to be at. So maybe if the cards fall at, and, the, and everything happens right, maybe I'll find myself in New York City really soon. Um, and it, it should be a little bit warmer May 12th. So it's an enticing fight to go to, you know? So we'll see what happens. But the deal is done May 12th, Madison Square Garden. Lomachenko will... will try to further cement himself as the best fighter in boxing. And it's going to be hilarious because Linares is a, is a really good fighter. So if he goes in there and he dominates Linares, I'm looking forward to hearing what you guys got to say because some of y'all, Lomachenko could cure cancer and y'all wouldn't y'all would give him credit for anything. So it is what it is. It's boxing fans. But let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. The deal is done May 12th. I want to hear what you guys got to say about the fight. Um, you know, take the time to subscribe. Do, like, do all that good stuff. And like I say in every video, you can love me or you can hate me, but I'm just a kid from Dane. And so until next time, take care, guys.